Rob Clayton, uh, your swimmers are really getting better and better every week and uh, took care of Grand Canyon last weekend. We did. Uh, it's a great weekend for us, Brian. Uh, you know, the, the same guys were out there winning events, which is great. A couple of things that you don't notice, though, unless you really are studying the results. One, um, we, have, we put guys in different events the second day than maybe they're normal, and we still came out and, and we're dominating. Uh, in fashion. Uh, related to that, we had completely different relays um, from one day to the next. And uh, against a team, Grand Canyon, that's dominated the relays at the conference level, uh, we won four out of four relays over the weekend. So it was, it, was really, it was a tremendous weekend for us. Are you putting pressure on yourself, though? Because then you're going to have to figure out who's best where and if everybody's competing that well. No pressure. <laughs> no pressure. We're, we're, uh, we're excited. It's it's great to have options, and when you get down to a conference meet, which, you know, everything we do is aiming for the end of February, so it, it's great to have these weekends, great, it, they're, they're just great preparation for the WAC championships, so but when you get to the WAC championships, um, any athlete can only swim four relays, out, and there are five relays, and um, we, we, sh we should be competing to win all five relays. We just need to, you know, put, put that puzzle together. How about your team's mentality? Are they feeling uh, feeling their oats, so to speak, right now? Are they pretty pretty happy with themselves? Or are they still ready to work? Um, they understand what the process. I mean, we're swimmers, and so we we get excited over how we're swimming over a weekend. But we know it's all about making investments so that we can have that big return at the end of the year. So, uh, yeah, we're, we're excited. We're happy to see results. We're happy to see, you know, another thing over the weekend is we finished races really well. The back halves of our races um, were outstanding. And time and again, we were the better team coming home. And uh, so, so that was exciting. So it, it's great to see all those things. But um, we still have a little work to do this week. And then next week, uh, we're resting and getting ready for Texas A&M. Yeah. Are they uh, chomping at the bit for that? That's a, that's a huge meet. It is a huge meet. And w there's a lot going on at that meet this year because we're going to try and pick up some Olympic trial cuts. Um, we're swimming long course format in the morning, which is the international or Olympic format. And then at night, we'll be swimming short course, which is the college format. So it's kind of we're trying to get a lot of things accomplished that weekend. Um, you know, hopefully we haven't bitten off more than we can chew. Uh, but no, everyone's really excited. We're excited to swim long course. We're excited to, to race, uh, you know, some top teams in the country. All right, Rob. Thanks for the time. Thanks, Brian.